value most is family. Um, I'm very fortunate because I've got a close family uh, with my wife and three children and that drives me to um, a number of various things and it's been the inspiration of us starting the foundation through our daughter Emma. started playing for the Raiders at the age of 20 and uh, had a career that uh, expanded out for approximately 13 years. I was very fortunate, I was able to stay in the game and move straight into coaching. Moved into uh, coaching first grade at quite a young age and that type of uh, experience is a, a something that's invaluable. Emma once threw a thick shape at me at a McDonald's store and Emma might not like the colour of the straw, she might have wanted a vanilla thick shake instead of a chocolate thick shake and her only way to communicate with me was to throw it back at me. And that day was the day that I thought, you know what, it's important for me to speak out for a lot of other people who have the same situation as Emma where she can't communicate and people didn't understand because she's a normal looking young girl. So that was the inspiration for us coming out and talking about Emma's issues and disabilities and uh, therefore that's how the, the foundation was created. In a nutshell, the Ricky Stewart Foundation simply just wants to help families who are living with disabilities. The families who can spend some normal time whilst they're, they can put their child into a very safe environment, a very comfortable home with great care, with other children that have got uh, disabilities. Um, this gives that child some independency, but it also gives the other siblings and the parents some downtime, some to just do things that they can't do on a regular routine. So it's just, um, it's about ma making both parts of the family comfortable and happy. Generosity of local community, generosity of our sponsors, uh, sponsors are such as GIO. If they don't commit and give their time or give their money, we just don't have facilities like this here in Canberra. And it's such a special facility that we have so many happy families now. It's amazing what uh, getting cranky and trying a milkshake at me uh, has done. It's helped a lot of other families, helped a lot of other individuals, as in children who uh, are living with disabilities. You know, it was Emma's way of communicating to me that she was uncomfortable. It was my communication back to everybody else to show that these children are normal. They just have a different way to think at times and or communicate. It's a very um, humbling experience being known the fact that you are, you are helping some other people or other children. I was invited to a birthday party here two weeks ago for one of the children and to have that child come up to me at the front door with a big smile and hug me showed me why it's so important for us all to be um, committing to things like this.